This is the McLaren Technology Centre in Surrey. This semicircular glass building sits on a 500,000 square metre site which features purpose-built lakes, a wind tunnel and a gym for its 1,000 strong workforce. It's behind these 300 million pound glass walls that you'll find McLaren's F1 boffins. It's also home to McLaren Automotive which is where F1 inspired road cars are stitched together in super sized surgical wards. One such car is a McLaren 12C Spider, a £200,000 drop top supercar which, despite being in production for a couple of years now, remains a technological masterpiece of sleek curves, deep cooling vents and dihedral doors. Oh yeah, and it's still one of the fastest production cars you can buy today. The 12C isn't only fast, it is rapid. It makes your head hurt. It's that kind of fizzy feeling that you get in your chest, only something you'd experience in a fighter jet. Underneath the 12C Spider's bonnet sits a 3.8 litre twin turbocharged V8 with 616 horsepower. 0-62 takes 3.1 seconds and it's good for 204 miles an hour. Let me just reiterate that. A convertible supercar, 204 miles an hour. Happily, the Spider isn't just a case of all bite and no bark. It sounds wicked too. Even the little sheep like it. The sheep! See, they're all looking at it. They're all looking at this car. But unlike any other supercar, the 12C Spider isn't intent on breaking your balls with unbearable ride quality. Wait, what? Now one of the best things about the 12C is its independent hydraulic dampers which gives a supercar like this Rolls Royce levels of comfort. The 12C Spider is also a supercar you can use as a daily driver. The boots are decent size, the interior is great and it's even got a decent turning circle. I will prove it to you right now. Go, 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 go. Turning, 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 watching the very expensive wheels, saying hello to Mondeo man. See? Done. And then floor it. And then you've got a supercar! The biggest draw to the 12C Spider isn't being able to fit a short guy in the boot, however. It's the seamless power delivery, the addictive acceleration, and the retina detaching stopping power. A little squeak there from the carbon ceramic brakes. It just lets you know that you've uh, done well in life. Every time I brake, I'm gonna squeak just to say, well done, you got the upgrade. Oh yeah, there's an air brake too that deploys under hard acceleration. Wing goes up, wing goes down. Wing goes up, wing goes down. Lovely. True to form, McLaren's seven-speed dual-clutch gearbox gives seamless gear changes, while the electro-hydraulic steering offers rapid and confident changes in direction. Despite the enormous capability of the 12C Spider, it's not an intimidating car to drive. And while the 12C is probably about as wide as a Range Rover, it really doesn't feel it. The car wraps around you, you feel snug, cocooned. The 12C Spider then is one of the best supercars we've ever seen. I've run out of adjectives and clever things to say. It's, it's usable every single day and every time you do want to scare yourself, it will do it, but it won't kill you. McLaren, you do make one hell of a supercar.